Hi, I'm Michelle Vaughn, and I'm one of the art instructors at the Art Verve Academy. I'm going to be teaching printmaking, mark making, and rust dyeing on January 26 at the Art Verve Academy. In this video, I want to show you some of the pieces that I've created using the techniques and tools that I'm going to be teaching on January 26th. You might be wondering, well, why do I even need to create these? I like to create my own personal items for using in my art journals, and I will be teaching you ways to create your own personal items to use in your art journals. This is an example of an art journal spread that I created using the techniques that I'm going to be teaching in this class. I will start the day by teaching you rust dyeing. We'll use a variety of rusted objects to create designs and patterns on pieces of paper, tissue paper, and fabric if you'd like to bring some fabric. Next, we'll move into the studio and create patterns and textures using the gel plate and a monotype printing technique. Here I've used a botanical stencil to create a leaf mask and printed it with some paint, some color. You can see here a fern was used as a mask for a monotype print. And in this example, I used a mandala stencil. I will then teach you a second monotype printing technique where we use very cheap paper that you can tear up, cut, and use in your art journal pages. I'll teach you a technique to use a different kind of paint to do frittage, mark making, and imprinting using a variety of techniques and tools. We'll then create design drawings, tracings on tissue paper. Tissue paper is nice and translucent. You can use it on your art journal pages and your multimedia pieces because you can see through it and see the nice background behind. Here I'm showing you examples of tissue paper creations using tracing, freehand drawing, and mark making. I'll also teach you how to create your own unique mark to use in your art journal and your multimedia pieces to create pieces that are uniquely yours. The last technique of the day is using our glue gun to create designs and words that you then can use as a mask and create painted items, painted images using those masks. I hope to see you there on January 26th.